doing? You're gonna be an outtake? You're gonna be making an outtake? <laughs> Here for Drive Electric Colorado. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's an electric summer. <laughs> a little bit of uh, range anxiety, 16 miles. Plus, I have to go home today. <laughs> I'm at 60 miles of range, so we'll see how this goes. Cars and coffee was amazing. Okay, I just walked in. Here I am at the Denver Auto Show. Let's um, find where I'm going to be. I see where I need to go now. This lava limousine needs to be electric. That's for sure. <laughs> it's cool. I love it. Yeah, we'll see you in the neighborhood. Yeah, you'll see that or our other car, the Little Lava, is around. So, it does. So it actually sleeps before. We have two that go to the ceiling. Um, oh yeah, that's. What make a video let's make a video look I'm in the leaf haha <laughs> anyways this is the new 2024 leaf look at how different it looks it's only 11 miles on the odometer and it's got these buttons and things I don't have it's weird look how shiny that is ew what's that it's all the same though same interior same storage same everything it feels kind of like not my car, so bye!
is so quiet. Electric Colorado booth, and there are all kinds of people chatting up, signing up. Uh, the rides are going on up here, and it goes with right now. Um, I can only get so many of those. And then there's a whole bunch of um, people that are signing up for the Volkswagen rides up upstairs, and the drives are downstairs. So.
So this is yours? Yeah. This is I not come every year for man cave. Oh, so we show off window okay. tent, hair bronze, ceramic coat. Oh, so you were here last year? Yeah. With the Tesla Model Y? Yes. Oh, okay, yeah, that? I yep. do. Because I was then, like, why is it Tesla? I love Tesla. Yeah. Get, uh, I got to get a little, like, approval for something like that. Oh, sure. But, yeah. Um, you know what? You know, pe people love it. And the, the convention center, they really want to, but it's on a national level that they, yes. the test is not allowed to come. Okay. So, but now on a personal level, like a business, I can bring whatever car I want. You know, it gets a lot of attention. So it's, I took over the cars and okay. coffee. And then I was like, I'm sorry, I can't because of the auto yeah. show. So yeah. that's right. But see how the uh, fingerprints down here? Stainless steel. But now, now on here, Look, I, I clear brought it, no oh, fingerprints. Wow. And then that side's black. Wow. Clear brought. Kicking That's that was an amazing, yeah. I mean, incredible. <laughs> uh, but, you know, we figured out how to do it. We've already done uh, three of them now. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Here for Drive Electric Colorado. <laughs> He's got like some little cider trucks in there for twenty dollars. <laughs> I'm back again. All right. Hey. I brought my stepdad. All right. So, yeah, why he had to see it? Everybody's yeah. touching in too. Oh, you know what? Things. It's all protected, so yeah. they can touch it all they want. <laughs> well, except for that little panel. Where's the? Oh, it's up there now. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, this one will get see fingerprints. That, see that panel? And yeah. it's all dirty. But now it won't because then we got a clear bra on it. Paint protection still. Well, that's oh, I have, have 6,600 pounds. Yeah, it's like an F-150, pretty much. Okay. <laughs> and they call it titanium. Uh, stainless steel. Stainless steel. Yeah. Here it goes. It's draw. Oh, it's draw. Got it. yeah. Okay. yeah. What do you guys like about it? The okay. speed? We, I'm, I'm interested yeah. in your job. Well, <laughs> so what we did, this is an interesting windshield to tint, believe me, but it's huge. We had to get 72 inch. Uh, ceramic film to tint that windshield. We did 45%. So that's going to keep the heat off your stomach when you wear a black shirt. Um, the summers get hot. This will cool you down. And then uh, we also did a black paint protection film on this side. So this side, it's a great way to just change it up a little bit because they're all going to be stainless steel. And then the other side we did clear. So for right now, that's all we, we've done. We're going to probably still ceramic coat it. We're trying to figure out if we're going to do the whole car black or are we going to do the whole car with the clear bras. Okay, now, I have questions about coating in general. Yeah. Specifically, what color of car would you buy if you wanted to change the color? If it wasn't available? Black. Black. The reason why is because then uh, you're not going to see the gaps. If you have a white car and you're trying to go black, you're going to see some white gaps in there. It's almost impossible to wrap all that. So yeah, if you start with black, piece of cake, you go any color, no problem. Color. My wife did purple, and it, it actually turns from purple to pink, kind of shifts colors. We could do some crazy stuff. Yeah. What is the average? So <laughs> if you weird. do vinyl, four thousand. If you do paint protection film, it's going to probably be double that because paint protection film is going to last 
15 to 20 years. It has a 10-year warranty on it. Vinyl is going to last three to five years. So, and vinyl is not going to stop rock chips. So on the front, when rocks hit it, you're going to yeah. see the rock chips on it, whereas paint protection film, that won't happen. Man Cave, Colorado. We're at 92nd and Wadsworth in Westminster. Uh, we've been around for 14 years now. Uh, been in that location for 10. Got voted best detail shop in Denver 10 years in a row on Denver Day List. So well, we uh, we have a cool shop. It's it's a great place to come pick, uh, see some cool cars. We always got something neat there. Yeah, mancavecolorado.com. Or we're on Facebook, Instagram, all those things. No. <laughs> Did you buy this vehicle? Yep, I ordered it four and a half years ago. Fifteen hundred and eighty-nine days I waited. Uh, I, I memorized everything. My RN number was one one eight. I mean, I'm a Tesla fanatic. Love it, and uh, I, you know, finally it's here. Well, how did you get this into the show? Well, you gotta know people, you know. So I had to beg them and say, you know, hey, I want to bring this. This is really a booth to promote our product. So it's not really to sell the car, but everyone that. wants to see it. But yeah, yeah it's uh, they don't have a booth here, but I guess I'm their best sales guy right now. <laughs> this was one hundred two thousand, um, but you know this is a seventy nine thousand dollar version. This is a founder's edition, so you pay a little bit more, you know, to be one of the first. Yeah. Well, do they come in other colors? Nope, they're only stainless steel. We're the ones that are just wrapping it, changing the color. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Wow, I am sitting in the Blazer EV. Look at this. <laughs> I can finally sit in it. Last year I was not sitting in it. <laughs> People will buy it. advertising is it Imagine that. How did you get it in here? 
Uh, just drove it. Oh, yeah. I mean, like, did they ask you to come, or how did that... Oh, so... Figure out how to do it. Kyle, uh, up in Fort Collins. Oh, yeah, I know Kyle. And then, uh, we also did, uh, Tesla employee. Oh, cool. Yeah, so Kyle did my interview. I drive a Nissan Leaf. Oh, okay. I do nice. road trips and car Oh, trips. very cool. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So if you go to my YouTube channel... Absolutely. This will go, this will go right to it. All right. Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. All right. <laughs> I'll see you around. All right, yeah. Take care. You got more questions, so... All right. Yeah. Sales guy right now. <laughs> <laughs> that was worth it. <laughs> 